Hi there guys and in this tutorial I'm going to be teaching you how to make this nice sleek intro in After Effects CS4 or CS5 so let's just have a look at this intro we have the text coming in here followed by presents and then some more text appearing on the side and a URL YouTube URL now this is pretty good because you got your obviously it's going to be your YouTube name um, presents then you can add some whatever text you want here and then the URL is going to be sort of for if you if you're on a, doing guest videos or say you're people who do those um, montages or whatever they are and put them out on other people's channels to see, then they got that URL there so they can go straight to your channel. So that's a really good thing. Now we're just going to get started on this intro. So we're going to go up to composition, new composition. Now I'm just going to be using the HD TV 720 29.97. Um, keyframes per second, making sure my duration time is 10 seconds long. Hit OK. Now I'm going to go to Layer New Solid and I'm going to be choosing a nice grey, so a nice light grey and I'm going to want to copy this code. Now it's vital we copy this code for later on and that's going to hide the text that comes out so I'm just going to show you. Making sure it's comp size, click OK. So we'll, you'll understand why we've copied that code in a bit. So we're going to choose the text tool now and I'm going to add the text that I want to appear out like you, that slides out All right, okay so I've got that like so you want to drag this to where you want it to sort of where you want it to be when it comes out of the you know when it emerges and I'm going to add presents as well now the font I'm using is antipasto um, you can download this font in the link in the description All right, okay so once I've got that, I'm just going to come up to, to my rectangle tool. I'm just going to create a box. I'm just making sure it's bigger than my text, like so, and make, making it all the way to the edge of the document. Uh, okay. Now in the fill, I'm going to paste that code. So this is where it, we need that code. So I'm going to paste it in, like so. And there we are. It's changed to the same color as the background, so we can't see it. Um, now with the text, I'm just going to move my text out a bit, just over a little bit more like so and we're going to create another rectangle actually and that's going to be for the where it looks like the text is coming out of so I'm going to go to the rectangle tool making my fill color a darker color darker gray okay and I'm going to zoom in now just so we can see the text now I'm just going to create this little um, rectangle making sure it's quite thin up to you so it looks pretty good so there we are we have this nice little um, grey rectangle. This is where it sort of looks like the texts are going to appear from. So now we're going to go to the um, you, the main text. So mine's going to be pure creative designs. So we're going to go to that one first. Whatever Yours probably going to be your YouTube name or your company's name, whatever. And I'm going to hit P on the stopwatch. Um, sorry, P when I'm on the text and then I'm going to start the stopwatch. Now I'm going to click um, and drag all the way over so it's hidden behind of this um, the rectangle that we created there so you can't see it at all now I'm going to drag to about half a second on the timeline and I'm going get, to get back on that text there and drag it over holding shift to make sure it's perfectly doesn't move anywhere so there we are and then I'm going to do the exact same with the presents so I'm just going to get it to about one second hit P start the position stopwatch I'm going to drag this over so it's hidden and I'm going to go about half a second just in front half a second and drag this back out so now we have the text coming in but as you can see that's pretty boring at the minute so we're going to want to just add a blur to that so if I just show you if you come up here to this we're going to enable the blur and then we're going to choose the this one here on the text choose it for both the text and the presents Okay, I'm just going to collapse them now. Now, um, now it's blurred as we can see there. So it just gives it like it's it's fast coming in. So it looks like it's really fast emerging in. So that's that. Um, now we're going to go on to create the text for the other side. So we get the text tool. Um, I'm just going to add tutorials, and I'm going to choose and more. Now, if you do. Um, stuff like unboxings and reviews. You might want to add more stuff in. Just make the make this rectangle a bit taller and make your 
font size a bit smaller so you can add more in there now we're going to want it so it fades in so just around two seconds we're going to go to the tutorials or whatever your first choice of text is hit T that's going to bring up the opacity we're going to drag it all the way down to zero start the stopwatch drag how long you want the text to appear so that's just going to be just before three seconds for me I'm going to drag all the way up to 100% and then so now we have this nice fade in it's just going to look slow at the minute but when it's actually sped up because you know uh, my computer's pretty slow so it's going to fade in now you're going to want to copy those keyframes so just click and drag over them hit control C to copy them now on the and more I'm just going to um, drag to where about I'm going to want it to be about just after three seconds hit T choose the opacity make sure you start the stopwatch hit control V now it'll paste the keyframes in so it means it's the same duration time coming in as the tutorials one so it makes it just look a lot better there now we're going to want to add the URL so I'm just going to drag just after four seconds get my text tool and I'm just going to write youtube.com you can add the um, www dot if you want but I think people know that they have to type in that and then I'm just going to write pure creative designs so that's going to be your YouTube channel that you're going to want to type there so it means that if you're ever doing guest um, videos for any other channel then it, they know that you, they can come to you straight away so we're going to want to just um, drag it to where you want so you know where you want it to emerge so it's just going to be just after four seconds hit T start the stopwatch and control V to paste those same keyframes in so as we can see now um, and more comes in and then just not long after we're going to have that uh, URL link um, emerge now I'm just going to grab this end of t work end work area to end and I'm just going to drag this to where I want the um, intro to end so I'm just going to want it about six seconds and that is the end of the tutorial guys so this is what we created we've created the text coming in followed by presents then we've got this the other text emerging there and then the URL so that is it guys I hope you enjoyed this tutorial please subscribe for more After Effects and a load of other programs um, I've got a lot more tutorials on the way um, follow me on Twitter twitter.com forward slash pcreatedesigns links in the description See you guys.